now I would like to show you how to import items onto Pricebox. All right, so the very first way, the easiest way at the moment to do on Pricebox under my eBay store is when you list a new item onto eBay and it doesn't show up onto Pricebox here. It means you still need to go and synchronize your store with Pricebox. Okay, so as you click on synchronize, it's going to synchronize with your eBay store, the, your actual eBay store. So the item that you added onto your eBay that's not showing on Pricefox means you still have to go and synchronize your store onto Pricefox itself. So it's loading the data onto Pricefox and it will show up onto your Pricefox account. So that is one way of synchronizing and then you can just go add it onto your repricer. Okay, second way is you go to the repricer tab you can import a CSV file. So if you exported a CSV file onto your desktop from Pricefox or from DSM or from SkuGrid, you can go ahead and you can import it onto your Pricefox account. Okay, so any option that you choose, you can go ahead and import the, the CSV file that you saved onto your desktop or wherever you saved your file that you exported from any of these uh, repricers. Okay, so as soon as you import, it imports the, the percentage of, 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 of your items from a different repricer. So from SkuGrid, for example, if you import, it will give you a data of what it is that can be imported onto Pricebox, whether it supports the stores, how many items will be imported that would be uh, available on price box will show up onto the file so it will tell you exactly what's going to happen before you approve the request all right so that is two different ways that you can import files import your products onto price box itself it's all in bulk you can do that easily and quickly with price box